Recently, I spoke a message at a local church. The title of the message was, How Important Are the Scriptures to the Lord Jesus? We examined what the New Testament records, revealing the answer to that question. The bottom line was that he highly valued the scriptures, and today's topic is the cornerstone of that answer. Welcome to How Should We Now Live in the 21st Century. My name is Duncan. Let's start by considering the fourth of the seven sayings that Jesus spoke while he was bleeding, dying on the Roman cross that he was nailed to. The quote from Jesus is, I thirst. The context tells us why Jesus said this, and the reason may surprise us. The obvious response might be because he was thirsty, and I'm sure he was. He said these two words because he needed to fulfill scripture. Last words of people are often quite important and telling. As Jesus died, his last words showed not only that he deeply cared for all of us sinners, but that they showed us that he highly valued the scriptures. This brings me to an important answer to how shall we now live in the 21st century. In light of how Jesus saw scriptures, the scriptures should be vital to us, even more important than our necessary food. Three years before his crucifixion, while being tempted to do a miracle after he'd fasted for 40 days, Jesus put it this way, It is written, He shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Paul tells us that the scriptures are given by God in order that, first, we may understand God's truth, second, we may be corrected by them, and third, we may lead lives according to the path of righteousness. Our job is to study and obey. If this video is a blessing, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and tell others. Also, please like this video. Notice added information in the description below this video that might help you in your study. My prayer for all of us is that the Word of God would be more important each and every day. May the Lord Jesus be with you and bless you now and forevermore.